getting a few actually done. I did want to finish this today. So our mom uh, started making these about 10 years ago, 2010. Uh, she had gotten a gift from one of her friends in Seattle and in that gift it had a bunch of Seattle specific items and she was looking around all over Long Beach to try and return the favor and send up a Long Beach specific item and she couldn't find one. So she decided to make one. It was a holiday exchange so she thought what better um, kind of item than a trees on the bay. <laughs> So uh, she made one that kind of looked just like this, um, a little ornament made out of wood and glue, and she sent it up there. And you know, she must have shown a few friends or family along the way because she started to get more and more requests for the ornaments. And um, that's kind of how this all began. Pretty much all word of mouth too, which pretty is crazy. Much. She yep. didn't use social media pretty much until like this year. No, <laughs> that was like, yeah, that was this year or last year that we got her on social media. So yeah. It's just something fun she has done forever, as far as we can remember, and you know, people have kind of affectionately started calling her the tree lady mm -hmm. as of a few years ago. Um, she kind of gets sought out every holiday season for her ornaments. This year, unfortunately, uh, she had a brain tumor in, uh, in May, May mm -hmm. and then she had to get brain surgery to get it removed, um, and then now she's fighting brain cancer. So. You know, when it came to do this again this year, she normally starts in June, July. Mm -hmm. It just sounded like such a huge undertaking based on what's going on. So we had talked about it back and forth, if we're gonna do it, kind of take it off her hands, mm -hmm. knowing that, you know, it's a huge project, but um, we decided to do it. And so, yeah, it's been fun. We've only been, been doing fun. it about a month now. Yeah. <laughs> it all got came together pretty quickly. We built a website and mm -hmm. we incorporated the business and, now we're trees in the bay with yeah. um, about 12 people, family and friends working with us mm -hmm. uh, to make this happen for the holiday season. Seeing it, the cutting, the painting, the gluing, and all the things yep. in between, it's been crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. Because we fun. all work, and so, you know, after yeah. you work eight to five, Monday through Friday, then yeah. we have this joke right now that free time is tree time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because that is true. we just every minute of free time we're working on it and it's it's fun it's a labor of love you can yeah, say for we're sure. all we get a lot of time with our mom too you know with everything going on and I know she loves that yeah. so she's really happy we've taken it up so there's lots of reasons and stories that people buy the trees and we've really enjoyed hearing them because that was always our mom's favorite yeah. part about selling the trees is hearing, hearing stories. everybody's stories and I got engaged at the trees and I did this yeah and it's been really cool to hear that from the community so yeah, I had someone tell me, we did a little pop-up on Saturday, and someone was saying that she was sending it to her husband, um, who's been overseas for months now, and he's from Long Beach, and so it was it was kind of a sweet story that she's sending him a little piece of Long Beach. So we hear stuff like that, I feel like, all the time, which is yeah. it's pretty sweet.